If you're a fan of cows' undercarriages, then boy is this the can for you. Hello everyone, and welcome to John Drinks, the channel in which I, John, drink something. And today, we're doing this pink number. Except it's not pink, it's a brown ale. This is by Norway Brewing, and these guys. I'll just leave that one to you. I'm not even going to attempt it. It's number 204. Presumably that means something. 7.3% and it's a lactose and cocoa brown ale. There's a little bit of a story here. Collaborations are an integral part of our brewing philosophy, and this is the story of two breweries from opposite sides of the Atlantic who, neither really liking brown ales, got together to brew a brown ale. This is going to be fun because, you know, the best things came out of hatred. Quite black for a brown ale, it has to be said. Also, this is going to be my first Swedish beer, unless I'm very much mistaken. I've had a plentiful supply of uh, Swedish ciders over the years, but I mean, who hasn't? Okay, let's uh, see what this smells like. Uh, chocolatey, there's a faint bit of hop in there, mainly molten grain. It smells kind of like a, a stout or a porter sort of a, sort of a style, more than a brown ale. Also, um, I'm going to shine this through the light briefly, just see if I can get any brown colour at all. Nope, this is... this is a black beer, guys. <laughs> Okay, well, uh, you can tell they don't like brown beers, because they effectively haven't made one. Does it taste brown? It tastes like a stout, to be bluntly honest with you. It tastes like a very good chocolate stout. Yeah, now this is the milk tray of beers. This is great. Yeah, there's um, no coffee elements or any of that kind of thing that you'd normally get from a dark roast. It is pure chocolate, this. This is the cocoa of beers. This is brilliant. I think it's just a mug of hot chocolate, except it's cold and also not brown. Yeah, I'm a huge fan of that. Dangerously easy to drink, this one. I'm um, having to remind myself it's 7.3%, so um, yeah, this will get you fucked up in no time. Have you guys tried any Swedish beers, or have you guys tried anything from these guys? I'm still not even going to try it. What do you think of the can design? I'm quite a fan of this, I've got to say. It's uh, very um, understated in its own little way. Also, am I wrong in saying this isn't a brown ale? It's not brown. Like the video if you enjoyed it, and also subscribe to the channel for more beer videos like this. Now then, I've got the last series of Star Trek Enterprise to watch, and, uh, well, I'm gonna need a few. Pardon me.